Hey baby, so we are finna get into this cash stuff in my wallet. We are in week four, I believe, y'all. And for those of y'all that don't know, we are a single income household, okay? Meaning my husband is the only one that works. And also he is a construction worker, which means he works in a plant and his income varies. So he might make $500 this week. He might make $1,200 this week. You just never know. So I try to do my budget off of that, okay? So this is basically based on a lower income, okay? But I'm going to always try to make it work out, you know, do what it do, y'all. <laughs> so let's just get into it, okay? All right. So today we are just cash stuffing um, the wallet. And y'all, the reason being, I want to tell y'all that is because you will see different amounts that I stuff each week, okay? Because, you know, this is life and I have to make it work. So, let me just get into it. So, right now, I'm just going to show y'all uh, what's in my wallet, okay? All right. So, what we got left. So, for miscellaneous. And I'm just going to put my budgeting book out the way, y'all, because I use this to budget as well as uh, do my denominations, okay? And I have a complete uh, flip through of my budget books that I made, y'all, okay? Let's just put this over here to the side if y'all want to see them, if you're not familiar with those budget books. Okay, so in miscellaneous, we don't have anything. And I know we don't because I didn't put nothing in it last week. And I have two envelopes because, well, you'll see. I'll show y'all when I get to that part. Gas, we should have $25 in here left. Okay, and what I do is I will take this money and I will put it behind in this envelope behind it just in case I need it for the week that we are prior in okay so see I had money left over in this one so what I will do is which is 20 21 22 23 24 25 I'll set this to the side and I'll show y'all what I'm gonna do with that uh, in a minute okay so if, I know I said that fast y'all so since I'm not gonna use since I had $25 left over I'm gonna put it right here in this envelope behind my gas envelope just in case I don't have enough money to cover this week's gas okay and then after two weeks i'll take it out if it's any money in this envelope like i just did right here y'all and i'll use that for something else okay so we had 25 dollars left in gas these are my receipts for groceries and of course i use fetch so i scanned all those y'all and food is just for groceries okay so let's see how much money we got left I actually gave my husband $30 yesterday because he went to the store for me. So I would have had more than this, but they wanted something different. And that's another thing. When you meal plan, I believe that helps you save money in the long run. So we got five, six, seven, eight, nine dollars left for groceries, okay? And I will just put it right behind in the envelope behind. I don't think I had nothing left from last week. I did not. Okay, so I hope y'all understand what I'm doing. For home, I didn't use none of this, y'all, because I didn't go to Sam's, because that's where I usually get my toilet tissue and stuff. So it's $30 left, and I'm just going to put it right behind here. And I might end up using this $30 as well as the one that I'm going to put in here uh, for this week, okay? Eat out, I know I didn't have nothing. I didn't even put nothing in this one last week. So I shouldn't have nothing left, okay? And then for me... My baby girl is sick, y'all. She's very sick. I put some money in here for me um, last week, but I spent it because um, i just been so busy, y'all. I've been trying to get her better, trying to keep myself from getting sick. So I was just taking money out of me um, because I didn't have it in eat out. So I was taking it out of me, and she had, when she finally wanted something to eat, she told me she wanted some Popeyes. So that's where that money came from. Okay, so there's nothing left in that. Games, this is for when I go to my nephew's games, but that's not started up yet. So I don't stuff this one. Okay, so baby, this is my husband. So I give him 125 every week, y'all. And that's because he works outside the home and he uh, drives and stuff. So he be needing to buy his lunch and stuff. So I want to make sure he always have money. So what I do is every week I set aside 125 for him, but I only give him that 100 Okay, just in case he come back and say, I need some more, I have it. So this is where this $25 come from. And then from last week, I know he has some left over. It might be 20 No, it's not 25 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Now what I will do is, because I have a sinking fund envelope with him, for him, I will put this money inside of his sinking fund envelope. And that's what I did last week as well, y'all. 
So if he ever comes to me and say, baby, I need some money, there's his envelope. <laughs> and I will put this $25 right behind um, his envelope just in case he need it. Okay? So that's how I do that. And I believe that's it. Let me see. Oh, y'all, what's wrong with this? Act like it don't want to go in here. Come on now, you want to go in here. <laughs> and y'all, I just DIY these little envelopes. I don't know what's wrong with this one. Anytime I have some little craft stuff and I feel like doing something, y'all, it pop up in my head, I just go make it. And that's what I did with this one. I don't know why it's not fitting right, but it'll be all right. Okay? So now let's just do the cash stuff for now. Okay, now for this over here, y'all, the money that I had left, which was 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Okay, so this came out of the gas envelope, right? And I still had the one that I had from this week prior, right? So I put this one back here. Now what I would do with this one, because it, it was in this envelope, right? So it's been sitting in my wallet for finna be two weeks. So what I'm gonna do with that is, with this $25, is I'm gonna put it in my big um, binder. So this is where I keep all of the money at. So I have a section for wallet, and I will just put it right in here. And I have some money in here already. I don't know how much. It's probably about $10 or something. I just put it right in here just in case one week I can't stuff something. I might need more grocery money and I just don't have it because my husband's check is short or something like that. I can go right up in this big boy and I can pull some money out, okay? So that's what I do with that. All right? So now let's just see how much money we got. And just like my husband, I also got me an envelope uh, for myself, okay? So let's see how much we bought this stuff for this week. I hope y'all been doing well because I don't even think I asked. Um, I've been doing good. I'm just trying to get my daughter better, and she is doing better, y'all. Thank the Lord for that. Woo. So we got 50, 100, 50, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. That's 300, 20, 40, 340, 50, and 55. 355? Y'all, I hope I counted that right. <laughs> trying to go too fast, girl. So now I just do, I go over here in my uh, budget book, y'all, and I have my cash breakdown for this week. I just have to find it. It's right here, y'all. Well, I know which de uh, denominations go and what, okay? So I will just put this right over here to the side. Okay, so for food, because we're not going to put nothing in miscellaneous. Okay, for gas, we are going to put $50 in there, and it's just going to be a 50 I should have broke that down more, but that's okay. Okay. For food, we're gonna put a hundred in there, which is gonna be two fifties. Okay. How y'all doing with y'all cash envelope system uh, since 2024 started? Home, we are gonna put thirty dollars in here, y'all. It's gonna be a twenty and a ten. Are y'all sticking with it? Y'all getting off track? Y'all just starting? I mean, how's it going? I hope it's going well for y'all. And just remember, like me, you don't have to stuff money in the envelopes every week. You just don't have to do that. Eat out, we're not going to put nothing in there. Me, I'm not going to put nothing in here. I could put the extra in here, but I I don't need nothing. Now, when I want to get my nails or something done, then I will stuff my envelope. But right now, I don't need it. My husband's going to be getting 125 so that's 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, and the five. Okay. Sorry, y'all, if this thing is moving. I think I bumped it. Okay, then we're going to go right back up here to miscellaneous, which is extra. And I'm going to put $50 in here, okay? And that is it, y'all. I hope y'all have a wonderful and fabulous weekend or week whenever y'all are watching this video. Y'all be careful and safe. And I will see y'all in the next video. Be blessed, okay? All right, babies.